scumbags. Taking the megaphone for some finance stuff. One point spreads. Corporate woman in the megaphone. This isn't right. They've been watching too much Love Police, these city index trading people. Scumbags. to all the city workers. We have unfortunately, we, the international bankers, spent all your money. We need you to work harder. Keep your heads down. Do not rock the boat. International finance is very real. We need to repay all those bailouts. The banks took your money. Now you're losing your house because of the banks. That does not matter. You are a worker drone. Do not follow your dreams. You are not a beautiful and unique snowflake. You are meant to wear a suit for 10 hours a day and obey someone called a manager. There is nothing more to your human existence. Ignore nature. You are a worker. You're on my friend's list. Tom, 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 yeah, how are you doing? You're on the phone. Thank you. How are you? Very well. I'm so glad to see you. No problem. Yeah, this well, is thank great. Thank you for the good work. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. Cheers. Keep yourselves asleep. You are not on this planet to enlighten yourselves and discover the divine beauty behind all things. You are here to work 40 years of your life to build up a pension. The government has you under control. Know your place. Your place is to work 12 hours a day in a glass and metal cage. You are not a beautiful and unique snowflake. You are a city worker. Your job is in the title. Work, work, work. Work harder than everyone else. Do not open that bar in the Caribbean. Do not become a yoga instructor. Do not become a comic book artist. Stay in your job. Stay terrified. Keep reading the newspapers about the recession. Keep reading about how Her Majesty's government now needs to tighten their belts to deal with all the money that they spent on your behalf. Stay asleep. Keep wearing your suit. Do not follow your dreams. We need you all to carry on working very hard to keep the economy safe. The economy is very real. All the money that the banks got bailed out with is very real. If you follow the paper trail, we promise you it is backed by gold, silver, diamonds, and platinum. Of course it is. The international debt problem is your problem. Bend over and let your manager tell you what to do. Do not follow your dreams. Keep doing as you are told. You are a worker drone and the queen needs you to keep the hive going. Finance is your new god. You are not a special human being. Your job is to work for 45 years in a glass and metal cage. You are the middle classes and it is your job to keep the hamster wheel going. How else will this government
are easier to control. Keep your heads down. Do not block the boat. This is a message brought to you by Her Majesty's Institute for Public Relations and Brainwashing. It's very important that you do not question the system. We spent 13 years from the age of 5 to 18 indoctrinating you with the system. Do not put it to waste. We need you to work very hard. We have big banking debts to pay off, don't you know? Forgo your holiday this year. Give your brain and your soul over to your company. Work harder. You too can get that promotion. You too can give more money into your pension pot. When you reach the age of 68, then you can truly live your life. Do not worry about living your life now. Work harder. Wear suits. Keep your head in a frown. Do not smile. Everyone else is a slave just like you. If no one else is doing anything, neither do you have to do anything. There is safety in numbers. You are all safe as long as you keep your heads down and work for the man. As they say on the gates of Auschwitz, Arbeit Mac Frei, work liberates you. Keep your heads down, work harder. You are not a beautiful and unique snowflake on a quest of enlightenment trying to discover the divinity of humanity. You are a worker drone. Your job is to work as hard as you can. Ignore hippies. Ignore anyone living an alternative lifestyle. You need money. You need mortgages. You need to work your 10-hour days in the glass and metal cage. It's very good for you. Do not bother having your own opinion. Let the mainstream media have an opinion for you. Do not question any of the wars, any of the big problems in the world. All you need to know is that the economy is going down the drain and we need you to work harder. Put in extra hours after work. Do not take your holidays. Your company needs you. The company is very real. Your life is not real. Your dreams are meaningless. It is your job to follow another 50,000 people every morning over London Bridge, looking the same, dressing the same, feeling the same, all with the same scowls. You do not need to smile. This is not funny. We need you to work harder to rescue the economy. The economy is very real. The money we promise you is all backed up by real assets. We promise you it wasn't financiers creating money out of thin air. Anyway, even if it was created out of thin air, we need you to work harder so we can pay it back. David Cameron and George Osborne are relying on the British people to work very hard. It is very important that Britain maintains its standing in the world as a financial powerhouse. And we need all the cogs in the machine to work that little bit harder this week. Joint, remove it from them. Smoking marijuana.
their heads down and working very hard, can we rescue this economy from the fake recession. We will pump more fake money into the fake recession, bringing about a nice fake recovery. But we need you to enjoy your fake jobs whilst we do all this fakery. We need you to believe the illusion is real. We need you to believe that your jobs are real, that your lives, your mortgages, your pensions are very real.